now. This guy is a regular on the Bob and Tom radio show. He's a staple on XM Satellite Radio. Lord Corrette, no, not Maurice Corrette. We're talking Lord Corrette. <laughs> He's currently on tour promoting his new CD titled Lord Corrette Unsweetened. Here he is, ladies and gentlemen, right here, right there. Thanks. Though I've never actually spoken face to face with the Lord until now. Uh, it's the first time. Now give me give me an idea. You are how old, sir? I'm 43. 43 years old, and you mm -hmm. started comedy when? And how, been, how did you get into this? I've been thing? paying my bills doing this for 20 years. And wow. uh, I started. I think the very start. Uh, my dad owned a bar, and growing up, I was always struggling to stay awake to either watch the bands in the bar or to stay up and watch the comics on Carson. And all my friends that went toward music had the same story that they saw the Beatles on Sullivan and went out and bought a guitar. With me, I was watching the Hollywood Squares, and they asked Jan Murray what the penalty for bigamy was. And okay. he said, two mother-in-laws. <laughs> oh, and I oh just said, that is a great joke. You know, you could translate that into Japanese and people would laugh. Yeah, and, absolutely. And I started trying to write jokes that were that timeless and, and that universal. Well, do you remember the first joke you've ever told? Because everybody has a, a, you know, knock knock joke or whatever, you know, banana, banana, you know. <laughs> everybody has one. Do you remember the first one well, you ever told? Well, the first one that I actually used for many years on stage was uh, a joke about a couple of friends of mine in high school. They were named Don and Sherry because their mom was a big Frankie Valley fan. Okay. And uh, they always made fun of her for the way that she picked their names. And I told them, girls, it could be a lot worse. Your mom could have been a big Tommy Rowe fan and you'd be named Dizzy and Sweet Pea. <laughs>